Hello, everybody. I hope everybody's doing okay. I haven't been on here for a few days. Um, the reason being is, guys, that uh, if you saw the last video, I had lost my little my little fur baby of 17 years. Almost 17 years. Not hardly, but almost. Like a few weeks. And um, I lost her Friday night. Well, Friday evening. And I just, um, I haven't been up to making videos since then. I've made one after that, uh, explaining to everybody what had happened. And I just wasn't into making any more right now. Um, but, uh, today's Monday and I'm feeling a little bit better, guys. Um, you know, I just had to have a few days there to mourn. Uh, she's been with me for a long, long time. I've had her with me now ever since she was eight weeks old and on april the 4th she would have been 17. so i've had that girl with me for a long long time now and i was really upset over it and i mean i'm still missing her of course and i probably will for a long long time and there's times i forget about her not being here and i go to search for her and then i realize that she's not here so yeah it's it's hard it's so hard on me but i'm better than i was and so i'm back to doing my videos guys um I, just, I haven't showed my queen. This is Queen Victoria, by the way, guys. That's what I call her. This is Little Miss Queen Victoria. Um, I haven't showed her in a good while, so I thought I would show her to you guys. This is the Keiko Sculpt. And look at her. She is so beautiful, guys. Um, I painted her in a like an olive skin tone. And she turned out so great. Look at her painting. I mean, she turned out wonderful, guys. Everything on her just turned out wonderful. I mean, her coloring, her hair color, her eye color, everything just goes to, she's just perfect. Uh, I don't see any flaws in her at all that I've made, you know, no kind of boo-boos or anything. And she's just a perfect little baby. And I call her Queen Victoria. That's what I call that gal. She's missing a hair bow. I don't know where it's went. She, had, she has one here and then she has one that goes here too. And I don't know where it's went huh well i'll have to find that came off somewhere guys but anyway she's got another one if it goes right here it's white so i'll have to find that for her and get it back on her i just it's came off somewhere i didn't notice it falling off uh i haven't had her out so it has to be somewhere here in the house but i'll find it and it'll be okay but this is queen victoria guys and um she is a queen that's for sure but uh, I keep her in this little suit that I bought. It, it's a little knit um, pants with a little knit uh, sweater type thing that buttons up. And then, she, of course, I've got her on underneath there. I've got her onesie on in there underneath. Because, you know, this could get scratchy maybe. And she's got socks on and under that too. So, uh, but anyway, I haven't showed her to you guys in such a good while, I guess, now. I thought I'd show it to you again. Uh, if you didn't get, a, get to see my last video, guys, I am closing in on the first Joseph Awake on his hair. I just like two strips on top. Probably about, oh, three to four more hours on his hair. And his hair will be completed. And then all I have to do is get his magnets glued in and um, for his passy and get his hair trimmed up real nice in a good, pretty nice hairstyle. And, um put his eyelashes on and then put the body together and I'll be done with him. So he's coming to a close. I'm almost through with him. And then I will have about two weeks before I have to start another baby. And so I'm going to take that two weeks to uh, do, go as far on mine, little Joseph awake with the blonde hair as far as I can with him. So I'll be doing that. And also I've got the silicone supposed to be coming in on probably Wednesday. Now she said the courier was scheduled to pick it up today and I should get it by Wednesday. So I don't know guys. We'll see. Uh, you know, I've had a time getting this, uh, silicone that that's what she said the other day. And I'm not going to message her anymore. I'm going to give her till, um, a few more days and see. And she said she would send me a tracking number. So I'm going to give her a few more days and see. And if not, then I'm just going to ask for my refund. I'm just going to ask for a refund back because there's something up there. Um, I don't know what. I'm not accusing nobody of anything. But I'm just saying this was supposed to have been mailed out to me last Monday. 
And I, I never did, you know, I kept not getting any updates and she wouldn't answer my messages and, and all like that. So, but now they, like I said, they did have a major snowstorm over there, guys. So that could have been what happened. Um, I don't know, but we'll see. She said it, the courier was scheduled to pick her up today and I should get her by Wednesday. So I'm going to give her till Wednesday. And if I don't hear anything from her then, or maybe Thursday, I'm just going to tell her, you know, please just refund my money. Um, you know, because I'm, I'm not going to do this. Now, like I say, I'm not, I'm not accusing anybody of anything. She had a really, really bad snowstorm over there where she lives. And I can understand that if that happened. Uh, but what I said was, you know, I'm an understandable person. If you just let me know what's going on. I'm very understandable about things. If things happen, they happen. You know, that's, you can't help that. But, you know, at least message me or something and let me know what's going on. That's the only thing I ask. Uh, you know, because I get, you know, we hear so many uh, of these horror stories about silicones, you know, and reborns. People scamming you on them. So, uh, which I'm not saying that's the, the case here. I'm not saying that at all. Uh, you know, I'm not calling anybody nothing like that. I'm not. But I'm just saying that. She told me the other day the courier is scheduled to pick her up today, and I should get her by Wednesday, so we'll see. Hopefully, that will be the case. But if not, I mean, I don't know what's went wrong or nothing, you know, with it. But if not, then I'm just going to ask for a refund back, and I won't get a silicone because I'll start looking for another one because I'm just, I'm not going to play those games. Um, You know, it's just, it's nonsense. But anyway, that's my opinion. Uh, like I say, not calling anybody anything, any kind of putting no labels on anybody or any, anything like that. I'm really not. And, and she has had a lot of trouble with snow and stuff. So, you know, I give people the benefit of a doubt. I'm, I'm good like that. I will give people benefit of a doubt. But I want to be at least be informed about it, as is anybody would. Uh, anybody would, you know, that has spent that much money for a doll and then nobody, the person won't contact them back or whatever and let them know anything, you know. there Anybody would be concerned over that. And the lady that I'm getting her from would be concerned over that if it were her in my shoes. You know, at least let contact me and let me know what's happened. You know, uh, I give people the benefit of a doubt if, you know, if that's what happens. So I finally just contacted her back and said, well, you know, I, I still want the baby, uh, it, you know, and if it's because of snowstorms or, or whatever, you know, I still want her, but just please message me and let me know what's going on. Well, that very night that I sent that message, she messaged me back and said that her, she had had a bad internet connections and stuff, which that could be true because of snow, you know, but anyway, I still give people the benefit of a doubt. I really do. And uh, so then that's when she told me that last message. She said uh, the the courier was supposed to, was scheduled, not supposed to, but was scheduled to pick her up today, and I should get her by Wednesday. So I'm going to give that. I'm going to give that much anyways, you know, till I don't know, maybe even to the end of the week. I may even give to the end of the week, and then if I don't hear nothing else, then I'm just going to ask for a refund. But anyway, guys, this, this is my little Victoria. I wanted you to see her. I haven't had her on in a while, and she says... Let's see. Let's try this one. She says, hello, everybody. Hi. Hi out there in Facebook land. Yay. <laughs> I'm being silly, guys, today. I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm I'm being on a little bit of the silly side. But, uh, yeah, this is my big beauty. She's so pretty, guys. Mm, she's my girl. She's my beauty girl, yes. Look how sweet. Isn't she gorgeous? She's so pretty, and she's always a happy baby, guys. Look at that. She's always happy. Okay, guys, I just thought I'd pop on here for a minute, let you see her, and then kind of give you an explanation as to why I'm being sluggish on the channel. I'm back, though, guys. I'm back to doing full force doing videos. I'm back in the swing of things, um, rooting dolls and, and, you know, getting them ready to go out and, and doing all these beautiful babies for people and, and playing with my own babies and so I'm back in full force, guys, and I appreciate all of you that said some prayers for me and all that. I really do, guys, because I needed them. I really did. I was a basket case there for a few days. 
uh, you know, I mean, just an absolute basket case. So, but I'm doing better now, and I'm back in the swing, so I'll be seeing you soon because I am going to get my videos going again. I'm going to try to do one every day if I can just get stuff to do it with. Problem is, it's thinking up stuff to do, right? Okay, guys, um, I'm uh, getting pretty close now to the 400 subscriber mark. So it's going up. It's just going up slow, guys. So we're going to get there at that 1,000 before it's over with. Uh, we will. And it's just it's going slow. And then on the 1st, of course, remember, we're going to be giving away that beautiful little um, light yellow little cardigan. It's got the pom-poms on it on the 1st of April. I'm going to be doing that and shipping it out to some lucky winner. And um, so as soon as we get to the 1,000, we'll give the baby. We'll send her home to her mom. And... Um, so you guys keep spreading the word for me. They're, they're going up. The subscribers are going up. It's just going up slow. So I'm almost at 400. So a little over another 100 and we'll be halfway there. So I'm proud of that. I'm very proud of that. We're doing good. Just taking a little longer than I thought. But we're doing good. So anyway, guys, I guess that's it. I'm going to jump off here. I've got to uh, do some work today. I've, you know, got to do some haircuts today. And, um... Uh, all that, so I better jump off. I gotta cook some. I'm gonna have chicken and dumplings for supper tonight, guys. I don't know about you, but I'm making a big pot of chicken and dumplings. Yum, yum. I love them. But anyway, guys, um, I'll jump off here and I will talk to you soon in another video, probably tomorrow. I'll try to make another one tomorrow. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. And I'll see you tomorrow in another video. Bye-bye, guys.